Strategic Vision Institute organized a national conference on disruptive technologies, warfare and strategy in Islamabad. More in the following report by our correspondent Reza Khan. Strategic Vision Institute organized a national conference in Islamabad on the topic Disruptive Technologies, Warfare and Strategy. The conference was arranged under the leadership of Executive Director SVI, Brigadier Retired Naim Saleh. We all uh, come across uh, in the media and in all the discussion forums about uh, the impact which the new emerging technologies are going to have on uh, our lives and uh, on particularly on the warfare in the future. And uh, we thought that it is important to discuss these issues, particularly uh, uh, involving the youngsters because they are the ones who are going to face these uh, in their future uh, endeavors and uh, in their research and uh, academic work. Uh, to get their views, provide them a forum to express themselves and also to initiate them uh, in this subject so that uh, once they move forward in their lives, uh, uh, they, they, they are aware of it. First session focused on global technology dynamics. It was moderated by Dr. Adil Sultan. Speakers from various think tanks spoke on various aspects of the topic. Second session focused on autonomy in warfare, artificial intelligence and robotics. Moderator of the second session was Air Commodore retired Khalid Banuri. Discussants delivered presentations on various aspects of the topic. Third session's topic was new domains, quantum computing, cyberspace and space. At the conclusion of the conference, Brigadier retired Naim Saleh delivered the concluding remarks. Strategic Vision Institute deserves credit for organizing a national conference which basically focused on the importance of disruptive technologies and uh, AI is also one of the challenges that was discussed. Uh, this remains to be seen how quickly uh, various institutions, be that in private sector or government sector, come on board uh, this new bandwagon of AI and disruptive technologies. This is Raza Khan, reporting for PTU World.